Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Jennifer Marie, where I teach you different ways to make money online and how to become a work from home freelancer. So a lot of you use PayPal, you use PayPal to get paid and also to pay for services. And one of the most annoying things with PayPal is they make it very difficult to figure out how to cancel a subscription or an automatic recurring payment. So let's say you've signed up for a free trial and you decide you don't want to continue with this subscription, you want to cancel it. Sometimes you actually have to go into PayPal and cancel it yourself and they make it difficult to find. So I'm going to show you where you can locate all of your automatic payments and how to cancel them. So first of all, you can log into PayPal and one way to do this is to scroll down under your recent activity and click on payment sent. From here, you can search for the transaction that you want to cancel. So let's say I'm going to search for any payment sent within this year related to the word fast. So you can see here fastwebhost.com, which is absolutely the worst hosting company in the history of the world. I want to cancel my hosting with them because they are just terrible. So I canceled it on the website itself, but they said, oh, you have to cancel it within PayPal. So even though I've canceled it on this website, they want me to actually go in and cancel my recurring payment of $6.99 every month within PayPal. So how can I do that? Well, one way is to click on this transaction. So I'm just gonna click here on fastwebhost.com and that has given me all of my transaction details. So from here, I thought, okay, I can scroll down, I can click on recurring payments dashboard, and surely that will take me to all of my automatic payments. Well, that is incorrect. These are for my customers, and this is not for recurring payments that I want to cancel. So what you actually have to click on is my pre-approved payments. I don't know why PayPal does not have a button that says automatic payments. You have to go through all these hoops to find this button. So you can also try to type in paypal.com slash my account slash auto pay. The thing is sometimes PayPal changes their links. So hopefully this will still work a year from now. Unfortunately, you're not able to search under all of your automatic payments. So you can click see more and locate the company that you want to cancel. So not all of these are recurring payments. For example, I have Cabify.com listed, and that means that I have approved payments to Cabify. So if I ever use the Cabify app, I can directly pay with PayPal as I have pre-approved this authorization. However, also what is shown here are recurring payments, and this is where I want to locate Fast Web Host to cancel it. So unfortunately, I have to go through and locate it individually. So now I've clicked here on fastwebhost.com and you can see that the status is active. You can also see the payment method. Let's say you just want to change the payment method for one of your automatic payments. They show you how often your payments will be made and they can show you the total billed amount as well. So what I'm going to do is just click cancel and basically, if you don't cancel at least one day before the due date, your payment might still go through. So I'm going to click cancel automatic payments and done. And now you can see it's inactive. Thank you. I no longer have to deal with this absolutely terrible web hosting company. So another way to locate your automatic payments is to go to account settings. So just go to your name here in the top corner, click account settings. Then click money, banks, and cards. Then scroll down to the bottom. You can see here all your pre-approved payments. So you're going to click on manage pre-approved payments. And this will get you to the page I showed you earlier. So you can go ahead and cancel any subscription that you want to cancel. If you have the PayPal app and you want to do it that way, you have to tap wallet, then automatic payments, then tap the merchant to view or update and you can cancel the payment that way as well. This is how you do it with the business account. And if you have a personal PayPal account, you're going to click on settings, then payments, 
then automatic payments, and then select the merchant that you want to cancel the subscription or payment with and click cancel. So I hope this video helped you guys out. Let me know if you have any questions at all related to PayPal and you can leave a comment in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you in my next tutorial.